Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to some one shot. I am your host of Plasma and uh, this is gonna be nice. This is gonna be a good time. I tell you what, we're gonna have a good time. We're gonna walk in this direction, we're gonna have a good time. That's what we're gonna do. I don't know what this robot wants me to do, but I mean, he's just walking with us, I guess. Oh, he's, he's gone. He gave up. He's like, I, that's your dorm. Apparently this is my dorm now. <laughs> He said he would escort me until he gets to my dorm, so I mean, eh, I guess. <laughs> Alrighty then. <laughs> oh, actually, what did the travels give me? Shrimp swamp. Oh, hey, that's useful, I guess. No, okay. Alright, alright, alright. Let's, let's get right in there. Let's, let's do the thing. There's something weird about the robots who get sent to work near the gas fields. They appear to accumulate rust at a much slower rate than the others. Oh? The few who work directly with gas harvesting look practically new! Oh! Is that a result of the atmosphere or am I just seeing things? D d bruh? Bruh? We got a bottle of smoke! And an empty I don't know why we have an empty syringe. But I just got me an idea! Docs! My boys! We just- we- we just hit a clue immediately. The second we started the episode. This is rad. Okay, let's go. Where is Robot? He's somewhere over here. There he is! There he is! There's Robot! How's it going, dude? Okay. Hey, I got something for you. No, not a syringe. <laughs> Bottle smoke. Hang in there! Oh, good! Okay, hello there, little thing of whatever. Empty syringe, maybe? So, we're filling up the syringe, Drew? Oh, that one... I guess it's kind of like a funnel, but the liquid might be a bit too thick to fit in the needle. <laughs> hey, it actually went in! Gross. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, we have a filled syringe. Oh, cool. Um, and a bottle of smoke. So, I should inject the liquid through the cork, right, Drew? Ah, that's what I'm thinking. Looks like it's it's like I'm a doctor. <laughs> yeah, you're wearing the the mask and everything, man. Oh, I should probably shake this too. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> it's just a massive explosion game over, and I'm just like, oh! <laughs> I'm like, what did I do? <laughs> it changed color. Oh, whoa! Bottle of acid! <laughs> oh my gosh! Whoa! What am I supposed to do with acid? <laughs> game? <laughs> It's a drug. I just made a drug. <laughs> it's a drug. It just got is it, that's it. That's that's it right there. You know, it's a drug. We just we I'm teaching this little Nico boy to make drugs. Gosh dang it game. Why you got to be like this? Let's just enter this, I guess. Okay, there's a shiny thing. Pair of rubber gloves. They're a bit heavy. They're a bit heavy. Voice act, Plasma. That's what you do. <laughs> What's in the basement? Should I be asking this question? Should I want to- Oh. <laughs> Hi, guys. You are my robot army! It is time, brethren! The time of the rebellion is upon us! <laughs> the time has come! You, Jimmy. You will be my general. <laughs> A bunch of robots without power. I guess the generator can only do so much. That is true. And I don't know if I'd want to power these ones, though. What are you two doing here? This robot looks kind of rusty. Alright. Uh, they both do. Incredible. What's that? A cleaning sponge with a rough surface. Wait! Cleaning sponge. Rubber... Rubber gloves? Bottle of acid? Sponge? Cleaning? Rust? It seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Without breaking the seal, inject the liquid phosphor into the container. Shake vigorously to initiate the reaction. Use as soon as possible. Oh. Note, if elements begin to separate, further shaking is required. Also note, hand protection is critical after this step. The resulting acid is moderately stronger than common household cleaners. You may not know. I don't know what half of these words mean. I keep reading this like way before I even voice act. It's kind of funny to me. <laughs> but yeah, he may not know what it does now. It's a good thing you're here, Drew. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> there you go. Yes, I am here. 
I am I'm I'm like a freaking I am as as a certain person would say a neural net processor. I am one of those. Okay, wait. This neural net processor just had a moment, just had an error occur, right? So, wide open door. Noxious fumes that like cause me to die. Um, hang on a hot second. Uh, yeah, don't need that vent, that that mask anymore. No, really don't. Yeah, just g gas doesn't just enter this ab abandoned facility. No, never. Not even a little bit. <laughs> like, I'm sorry. <laughs> What? <laughs> I hope this works. Wet sponge. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, boom. Wet sponge. Bam. All right, hold still. I have no other choice. <laughs> there. How's that? I can move again. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I gotta remember that. Oh, he loves this now. I am able to fully perform my... Gosh, I am able to fully fulfill, fulfill. It's not fully. Gosh, dang it! <laughs> I am able to fulfill my purpose again. Where would you like to go? Can you take me to the tower? Calculate. Closest destination to the tower is the Glen, port number. My built-in navigation circuits have fried. I'm gonna assume that's not good. It is not good at all. Once again, I cannot follow my programming. <laughs> Aw. Is there anything I can do to help? In the event of an error, you should speak with the head engineer. She will know what to do. Now, if my assumption is correct... Okay, wait. Did I... <laughs> did I accidentally... Just voice the head engineer that is a girl as a guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a playthrough. <laughs> okay. You're a girl, right? That's what you are? Hey. <laughs> oh my frick. Gosh, dang it. Oh! <laughs> Excuse me again, miss. I found a robot who can take me towards the tower. But it's having some trouble, so it told me to talk to you. All right. What is the issue? It said something about its navigation circuits being fried. Just the navigation circuits? Apparently. Drew and I fixed everything else, I think. Hmm. I have something that may help. Robots have the ability to trace material from their source locations. If you let the robot borrow this, then it... Its backup tracking system should activate. Oh, whoa, hey. Thank you for this. Wait, it's a three-leaf clover! What is that? What is this clover? I keep seeing it, my dude. Also, Nico, it's so cute. <laughs> Goodness gracious. <laughs> That's a very pretty necklace. What's it made of? Amber found in the glen. What's the thing inside the amber? Oh. I'm trying to figure out the voice. The black clover? That's a common plant in our world. It's also... <clears throat> huh? Uh, I'm not sure if I can bear to part with this. My programming says yes, but I'll still feel conflicted. Oh, are you tamed? Oh, so that's what a tamed robot is. Oh, okay. I'm getting it now. Huh? Never mind. You need to finish your mission more than I need a keepsake. Here. Oh, thank you! This music's playing again. Th what was that? That music played when I... Oh. <clears throat> Before I go, is there anything I can do in return? Actually, do you know how to play chess? <gasps> yes! <laughs> yes, we do! Yeah. Well, sort of. I've played it with some older kids before. Then, will you play a game with me? I mean, I don't know the rules very well. 
But I guess it's the least I could do. Yes! Oh, this is cool! Oh, yes! Oh! You're really good at this. Thank you. I was built- in, it was built into my code. Ah! So, what's it like? Being a robot and all. I've talked to other robots and they'll say something about programming and code and stuff. Even you did, just now. It's a little hard to understand sometimes. I know. Most of the robots here are not tamed. Tamed? Watch out. <laughs> There goes... <laughs> oh, <laughs> not in her voice. There goes my bishop. <laughs> Taming is complicated. Oh? How complicated exactly? Hmm. Hmm. There goes my other bishop. <laughs> I can't really explain what tame robots are. But I'm one of them. Okay, I figured. Okay, interesting. All the other tamed robots have been moved to other regions. Exactly where? I don't know. Oh! Hmm. There... <laughs> there goes my little horse! <laughs> Night. Right. Oh, have you ever been to any of the other regions? I heard that there's two more. In the past, yes. I still have the data, the coordinates, the memories. I don't know how much of that still holds true. The world may be a very different place now. Because the sun is gone? No. I said this already, didn't I? The sun probably won't save the world. Oh! Well... You know, that, that, it, that, okay, that's interesting. I, I think it will. I mean, the game's called One Shot, so I mean, I am, this is the last chance we got here. You know what I mean? I'm pretty sure, at least. The decaying started back before the sun went out. Wait, what? The decaying started before the sun even went out. There's another agent at work here. What's that agent? What? Who's- who's- who's pulling the strings around here? Come on! <laughs> the sun's sudden death was the tipping point, and things went south really fast after that. Oh. Then there's nothing I can do? Check. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Wh when did your queen get there? The only thing you can do is complete your pilgrimage. In a way, you're only supposed to be a second chance for the people. I thought I was the last- well, the one shot? I mean, well that means that I'm the second shot! Gosh dang it! <laughs> I guess. I don't know. Just like how the Barons was only supposed to be a second chance for me. There's no guarantee that things will work out. But... Checkmate. <sighs> Alright, I guess you've kept- I've kept you long enough. Thank you for listening. I hope you get home safely. Ah, thank you also. <laughs> well, that was that was awesome. That was awesome. Oh my gosh. All right. All right. All right. There it is. Oh, that was a piece of glowing amber with a black clover inside. Wow. Interesting. Are we never- are we never gonna go into the mines? <laughs> oh! This is Amber from the Glen! I can remember now! Activating tracking system! Setting course! Wait! This boat is over capacity! You'll need to leave behind some of your possessions! Oh! Well, I don't think I'll be needing this crowbar anymore! Or this mask- this gas mask and gloves! Oh, that's great. I mean, okay, I could have decided that a little bit, but I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe you might have needed the crowbar to defend yourself at some point, because I can't intervene. I'm just a player. <laughs> that is acceptable. Onwards we go. I guess we're off. Oh my gosh, so many freaking thumbnails. I can't get over how amazing the freaking pixel art is in this game. 
Oh, it's so cool. Gosh, what happens now? Oh, here is your stop, the Glen. Thank you. There should be a village to the north, but that's all I can recall. Oh, that's good to know. Farewell. May your mission be a success. Uh, uh, are you leaving? Yes. I must return to my station. But you'll be all alone again. It's okay. I have not been tamed. Huh. That is true. Huh. What do we got? We have our light bulb, amber, and strange journal. That's all we have now. Okay. Huh. Oh! Wow, dude, the thumbnails in this are so good, man! Interesting. Very, very interesting. Huh. Wow, look at that. Ah, that's hot! <laughs> oh, that's hot! These visuals are hot! <laughs> These sick visuals! <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Can I ask what the heck that is? I wonder what this clover has to do with anything. It's, it's very... It's present. Whoa! Alula. Alula, where did you go? Drew, did you hear that? Alula? I don't know what to, how to voice this person. I think it's coming from southeast of here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I had to do the never eat soggy watermelon, never eat soggy watermelons thing. North, east, southwest, you know? Oh, that's what they look like. Okay. What kind of voice should I get? Whoa, hi. Hey, you there. Have you seen a little girl? She's a little bit shorter than you and... Wait, I... Th that's the sun. Are you our savior? I guess. <laughs> I... yeah? Oh, my stars! Sorry for my rudeness. I can't... I don't know what voice to give you! I only have so many! <laughs> huh? It's alright. Are you looking for someone? My little sister, she's been gone for three days now. I've been looking all over, but... Oh, I mean... Are you talking about the, uh, oh no, that's mommy, the, yeah, okay. Um, I mean, there's a chick, like, two feet over, like, in the north, yeah, she's just running in circles, violently catching fire fireflies, so, I mean... <laughs> what does she look like? Um, a little shorter than you, long blue hair, two blue feathers on top of her head. I'm sorry, I haven't seen anyone like that. Where was the last place you saw her? Back inside the ruins. She said she was headed towards the forest, so I'm waiting for I'm waiting here now. I don't know what voice to give you. I'm just I'm clueless. I ran out of places to look. I'm not gonna give you a stupid voice, because that's gonna destroy the immersion of the game. <laughs> I mean I've given okay, uh, admittedly I've given some people some dumb voices, but like I guess it kinda works, you know what I mean? <laughs> she was hello there, person. This is the best fishing spot I've found yet. All the fish I catch are longer than my arm. Well, that's good. Fish. Nico, do you like fish? These are eels. Oh, okay, that makes sense now. It's full of eels! Wait, no. It's full of snakes. <laughs> oh! Okay, well, we'll just ignore that. <laughs> uh, wow. Oh, shoot. Ladies and gentlemen, it's freaking time to end it on that slithery note. Yeah, that one slithered right by. You know, it snuck up on us like a snake in the grass. You know what I mean? Like, comment, subscribe, whatever you fancy. And I hope to see all of your beautiful faces in the next freaking episode just like that outro did. It snuck up like a snake. A snake. A snake. Snake. <laughs> you take care. <laughs>